Welcome everyone to the ultimate game in the college football season. Everything has built to this. The battle for the national championship and college football immortality. A moment that every young football player grows up dreaming about. And it almost feels like we were destined to get to this point. The top two seeds of the college football playoff have survived. They've been on a collision course all season long. They've come through the challenges and the distractions. And now they'll fight for that beautiful trophy. As we'll see the number two seed in this playoff, the Texas A&M Aggies. Taking on a team from the Big Ten, the Northwestern Wildcats. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Chris Fowler. Joined as always by Kirk Kerbstreet. And this is it. Two teams enter. One team leaves here as national. Here comes a handoff. Breaking free at the 35. Ball carrier running through tackles. Out of bounds, but not before a huge game. Offense gets a first set of downs. Boy, a nice call here to start this national championship game off with a physical run. I think this offensive line has been a strength all year long, and here they get this game started the right way. First down play call coming up. How aggressive will it be? And the back gets the football. And the senior able to make the stop after a short game. Offense getting set up. Here's second down. To throw. It's Barber. He's moving out of the pocket now. Extending the play now. And tackled there by the defense. So the offense getting set. This is not where you want to be against this defense. Third and long. Dropping back. We're going to throw for the first down. He's looking to scramble. And a big game before he goes out of bounds. The offense keeps churning. Gets a fresh set of downs. This Northwestern offense is quickly moving down the field. From inside the red zone, they're looking to throw. Gets the ball off as he's hit, but it's incomplete. How about the defense's effort here? You're dealing with one of the more athletic quarterbacks in the country. Anytime he scrambles, you better have three or four guys pursuing the football. They do a good job of affecting his rhythm by pressuring him to the whistle. And he's brought down after a short game does not make the first down yardage. They're backed up here trying to make something happen on third and long. Scrambling around now looking downfield. Touchdown, Northwestern. Offense setting the tone early. And wow, that is how you kick off a national 
championship game, Kurt. Man, Chris, you're exactly right. This offense came out with a mindset that they're not going to wait around and wait for this defense to get settled in. They're going to punch them straight in the mouth and assert themselves. What a championship-level statement that was. snap motion from the receiver out of the shotgun he hands it off moves the ball up to the 30. it's a good solid game five or six yards love to see that from the running game the game makes it second and medium a pop pass on the jet sweep you bring him down but he makes the 40 yard line that's a solid game the defense has got to do a much better job here of adjusting to the pre-snap motion. They just kind of stayed in place, and it gave the receiver plenty of room there to make a nice play. They tackle him behind the line, a loss of four. Offense getting set, second down play here. The throw, it's Barber, bringing pressure. Going to try to use his legs here. He's found some room at the 45. An explosive play moves the ball across midfield to spot it at the 38. Northwestern getting set with a first and 10 coming up. From the shotgun now, here's a handoff inside. Hey, listen, you don't always have to have big plays to be successful. It's a nice, solid game here. Keeps you on schedule, and you get ready for that next play. They'll switch it up, looking to throw. Looking to scramble. Using his legs here makes the defender miss. The defense will wrap him up, but he's able to scramble for a first down and keep the drive going. Northwester now operating in the red zone. They're going to run it. Back gets the carry. Got a lane. Can he get in? And he gets to the end zone. Touchdown, Wildcats. Boy, as a defensive coordinator, you've got to be careful being so worried about this game from his quarterback that you're a little bit soft up front and it costs you. It's exactly what happened here as they score this touchdown. Single back takes the handoff. Breaking free at the 35. Breaks clear. End zone ahead. Crosses the 10. They could not stop him. He's in. Touchdown, Northwestern. Oh, my. What a great play call here by the offensive coordinator. The running back received some great blocking up front and just took off with it, carving up this defense all the way to the end zone. game here. Tailback has the handoff. Solid game. Moves the ball to the 43. Second down play coming up. And there's the handoff. The junior able to bring him down quickly. Crucial third down play right here. Looking to throw. It's Barber. Trying to extend the play. Looks like he's going to run it. And he moves the ball across midfield and picks up a first down. Offense will keep it on the ground here. They get him down, but not before he gets to the plus 38. This Northwestern offense is quickly moving down the field. On the shotgun, it's a handoff. It's good for a three-yard gain, so second and seven. 
From the gun, he looks for an open man. On the run, he'll let it go. Oh, it's incomplete. That's a good job of the defender to break that up. Offense been in reverse here. Now a long way to go to convert this third down. He's escaping the pocket now. This one's going to fall incomplete. Brings up fourth down. Hey, the good news is here, Chris, they're still in field goal range. And it Running back with the football. You bring him down, but the drive has now reached the 35. Sometimes I almost get mesmerized watching these runners who have great vision. You know, the eyes that carry their feet to the open space, making people miss. I just love watching those guys do work. Breaks loose at the 45. The defense gets him, but it's a first down. Shows you how dangerous he can be scrambling. There's the snap, and he's looking to throw. It's incomplete. He was hit as he threw. Good pass rush there on first down. Here's the second down play. Looking to throw. It's Barber. He bought some time, now lets it go. Not able to connect. Incomplete. Chris, I don't know if it's the hype of the national championship, the timing between the quarterback and his receivers, but they have not been able to get anything going at all here in the first half. And the problem is, they're already down in this game. They've got to put the ball through the air and start hitting some passes, or there's no chance they come back and have a chance. for a big play here. Caught way downfield for a huge game. They're not going to get him. He's in. Touchdown, Wildcats. Looked like a total bust there. Easy pitch and catch like you'd seen in a Tuesday practice. Yeah, that quarterback's eyes must have lit up on that play because you've got one of your players way downfield without any defender around him. Now throwing here to start the drive. Looks downfield and connects with a wide open wide receiver. Potentially a touchdown saving tackle, but not before a long completion. The new set of downs after that completion. And why not goes in motion. Looking to throw it on first down. He's moving out of the pocket. He's on the run. Launches deep. The deep shot is caught for a big game. Touchdown, Northwestern. And they will claim the second half lead. Another touchdown strike. You win national championships with the elite quarterback play. And Kirk, this guy's putting on a show. I mean, this is a national championship. Can you imagine having this kind of performance? This is something that we'll always remember. Right now, this defense is overmatched with his ability to throw the ball and the receivers' jobs of running routes. Everything's in sync. Takes the ball, tries the right side here. Gets some space around the 30. Oh, and he breaks free. It's a foot race. The 10. Touchdown, Wildcats. No chance to catch it. That's another touchdown, a dream performance for this running back on the biggest possible stage. I mean, Chris, we're talking about the national championship. This defense has had a lot of time to prepare. They've heard all about him. In fact, they told us the only chance we have to win this game is we've got to stop their ability to run the ball and stop their running back. So far, they are struggling.
And they'll run it. Hand it off to the running back. Nowhere to run up the middle. Well, these are the kind of plays you have to make to be able to win the game in the second half. This back had a great first half and has gotten plenty of touches, so you've got to make sure this half is different than how things have gone so far. Ball carrier wrapped up and brought down. Chris, that's another nice pick up through the air. I, I thought they might be really just out to run the football here with the lead. But instead, they're electing to throw the football. Different routes, quarterbacks in rhythm. Really, it's almost an extension of their uh, passing game. Northwestern getting set with a first and 10 coming up. On the ground, it's Porter. The gain is four, so it's second and six. Hey, you got to do what you got to do. You got to rely on that offensive line in the running game here to be able to secure a victory. Good call, and just keep working that clock. Quarterback leaves the pocket on the move now. Catch made a lot of space now. Four set of bounds after a big game. This offense set up with a first down. After that huge play, this offense is now in scoring position. They moved into the red zone quickly. Boy, Chris, you wonder what the next play will be for this offensive coordinator. Anytime you hit a big play like that, you get into the red zone. There's a 10. Got space looking to score. Touchdown, Northwestern. This offense is still clicking. So the quarterback says, I'll do this myself. Griffin just takes off and flashes the speed in the touchdown run. My goodness, his creativity and speed makes it almost impossible to stop. If I'm the defensive coordinator, I start locking in on this quarterback's ability to run. Because if you don't, you're going to see a lot more plays like this. off here from the shotgun to bring him down right at the 30 yard line boy is this guy fun to watch or what here we are in the fourth quarter critical down in distances and this guy is just churning out yards the way he has most of this game showing a lot of physicality and natural running instincts in space breaks into the clear it's a sprint finally brought down but that play moves the ball all the way down to the 21 what a pitch and catch by the quarterback and receiver for a big gain for this offense. Another chunk play. This offense is really clicking. To the air, it's Barber. On the run here, lets it go. And it's incomplete that time, just out of reach of the receiver. Incompletion makes it second down. From the shotgun now, here's an inside give. Well, how fitting for him to get another nice carry here because it's been that kind of game in the national title. We knew coming in that he was going to be showcased. I didn't think he would have this kind of performance on this big of a... He's got some room. Can he get there? And he runs it in for the score. Touchdown, Wildcats. You could just tell this quarterback knew exactly what he wanted to do as things were developing in front of him. He saw that open space and decided, I'm just going to take it myself and head to the end zone for a touchdown. Handoff as they try to work the clock here. Tackle behind the line. It's a loss of two. Important second down play coming up. From the shotgun, drops back looking for an open man. Tries the right with a quick throw. That's going to be incomplete. A lot of contact. No flag brings up third down. They come to the line. A long way to go for the first down, but needing this crucial conversion right now. On the run, he'll let it go. And it's intercepted in a desperation throw here. Can he take it all the way? It's a big return off the INT. They steal their offensive possession. 
Boy, just when it looked like they had complete control of the national championship, they turned the ball over. The only real mistake they could have made to give their opponent a chance to get back into the game, and they've done it. Using his legs, it's Porter. Right down at the 33, that's good enough to move the sticks. Now a timeout taken by the defense, trying to preserve as much clock as possible for their offense. And in first down, they go right back to him. Tackled behind the line, it's a loss of two. And now it's the defense that calls timeout here, trying to get organized and preserve as much clock as possible. Second down play coming up for this offense. Shotgun formation. Here's an inside give. It's a nice wrap up there by the junior. And now a timeout taken by the defense trying to preserve as much clock as possible for their offense. Not going to be easy here. Backed up a long way to go for a first down. They'll go with the ground game here. Running back takes the handoff. Picks up about five yards, but it's not enough. Here comes a fourth down now. Now this defense is going to have to. The last team standing at the top of the mountain, Kirk, national champion. Well, it's been so much fun to watch this team play all year long. They've had some challenging moments. They've been able to overcome them. And how fitting, a close game in the national championship. They come through one more time. And as you say, they hold the trophy. They are the national champions of the year. Well, that's it. Dramatic punctuation to another outstanding season of college football. For Kirk Street, I'm Chris Fowler, and this has been a presentation of EA Sports College Football. For the first time ever, national champions and your kings of the college football world, the Northwestern Wildcats.